Starlink has finally released an accessory for the new Gen 3 hardware that I think they should have released probably eight months ago or so. So the current generation hardware, which is Gen 3 or V4, has been out almost a year and the new dish came with a new mounting system. So previous Starlink accessories and mounts like the long wall mount, short wall mount, ridgeline mount, all that stuff designed for Gen 2 was not compatible with the newer dish. So people wanting to upgrade from Gen 2 to Gen 3 had to buy new mounts. But now finally, Starlink has released an adapter accessory that takes the Gen 3 and allows it to be mounted on to a Gen 2 mount. Better late than never, I guess, but here's what's going on. Let's take a look at the Starlink shop. All right, we're on the Starlink shop and let's go ahead and select standard. This is the Gen 3 V4 hardware. And we notice one of the first accessories that pops up, this one is brand new in the shop that I noticed the other day, is called the standard to standard actuated mount adapter. And it looks like it's exactly what the name describes, which is an adapter that takes the Gen 3 standard dish and adapts it to the Gen 2 standard actuated mounts. So like I had mentioned, this should have been available from the get-go, from the very beginning, but I'm glad that finally, finally Starlink has added this. Uh, those of you that are wanting to upgrade, maybe due to maybe not due to the performance because the performance difference isn't really that significant. Mainly the reason to upgrade is if you have a Gen 2 dish that breaks down. This, you have an issue with it, whether it's the cable or the router, and rather than replacing it with another Gen 2, you can just replace it with Gen 3. And this adapter means that you'll be able to use your existing mounting hardware to just install the Gen 3 right in place without having to buy or install new mounts for your new dish. So the interesting things here, um, first of all, $43, not too bad of a price, um, considering some of the mounts for Gen 3 are much more expensive than that. So if you can reuse your existing mount, this will be the cheaper option overall. The other thing that I'm noticing here is that it looks like the kit is actually basically just a mast and then the Gen 3 pipe adapter. So I guess it's an adapter, but really what it is is it just has a, a mast section here and then they use the pipe adapter to clamp down onto the mast. So really it, it's the special part here is just that little mast section. Um, that's all that really is unique about this kit. Interestingly, they do have a note down here saying that for customers buying a new standard kit and looking for a new mount, in other words, those that don't already have a standard actuated mount installed, they recommend that you go ahead and buy a mount designed for the Gen 3 standard kit and not use this adapter mount to buy an older mount. And I would totally agree with that. So it doesn't make any sense to buy a Gen 2 mount and this adapter just be able to use the Gen 2 mounts because actually the Gen 2 mounts are more expensive than the equivalent Gen 3 versions. So there's really no reason to go that route if you're buying a brand new mount altogether. The only time this makes sense really is if you have a Gen 2 system that you're upgrading to Gen 3 and you already have a mount installed for your older system. I've already got one ordered and I'll be doing a full review and tutorial for you all when I receive it. But I just wanted to go ahead and make this video update to let any of you all know that are planning on upgrading maybe from Gen 2 to Gen 3 to this is an option for you if you don't want to buy a whole new mount. So I'd, uh, I'd be interested to hear what you have to say about the mount in the comments below. If you have any questions or things that you'd like me to address in the video review when that comes out, let me know and I'll see you in the next video.